Happy now. Happy now. Happy now. Happy New Year's. Happy 2020. 2020 with the vision. Okay. This is Fresh Sage here. Signing back in. And this is a different scene. This is, you know, my living room. You know. And if I get like a tripod or some, some sort, maybe I could like put it right here. And I can like sit down and have, it's just a couple, some vision, visions I've had. However, um, I want to state like basically how my values, you know, going into 2020, going into 2020, I want to shed light on my values and my value systems and how, you know, it's changed over the years. You know, so, you know, as, you know, a spirit in this human vessel, I've had, had experiences, you know, where, you know, not being in utilizing my knowledge itself, like I said, in uh, my previous video, I wasn't quite sure, you know, of self, you know, when I was awakening, you know, to becoming my greatest version, when I was awakening to becoming my greatest version, um, I was eating meat, you know, and I was swaying away from the things that was supposed to, you know, make me, you know, become my greatest version for me. And, you know, this is why I say I can only speak for me, you know, because only I can de define that greatest version that I want to be, okay? Which is what makes it even more unique, okay? So, yeah, going into 2020 is, or in 2020, you know, I just want to speak on highlight, just highlight the growth, you know, because oftentimes we can just go through a lot of things in our life and just having experiences on top of experiences and it's like we never stop to check and oh and there's there's a doorbell but yeah we never really stop to check you know and look at the progress so um i just want to say that i'm proud I, I'm I am I am personally proud for, from for not only me recognizing the growth that I have done uh and also you know being reflected that and having people reflect back to me you know the growth the the level of growth you know that I've you know done in 20 you know now that we're in 2020 and yeah i guess i'm just filtering on you know what i really want to talk about which is of uh, values so you know when i wasn't into knowledge itself you know when i wasn't into knowledge itself um i didn't know like for example like the things that I should be valuing should is not necessarily things that you could value. Like my value system is, ex is extremely different from another aspect of self. So it's like, and simply, you know, how my second house of value is dealing with Virgo type things, you know? So it's like the things that I value are going to be of my the betterment of you know my health my my work and you know my routine you know so that's that's been a huge change that's been that's been that that for me you know I'm going to put shed some light there has been a huge change 
for me. Realizing that pinpointing values, analyzing my values. That's a good way to say it. Say it. Analyzing values and things that I value. So that's that's been something that I have, you know, I would like to shed some light on, you know. So, and yeah, it's like, just the level of, you know, consciousness that I have allowed myself to attain. Level of consciousness I've allowed myself to attain, you know? And yeah, it's almost like every time I turn on this video or this camera, I, I want to be sharing in the you know, the information that I, I come across and and just giving my, you know, own perspective, you know, and just genuine perspective too, you know, so yeah, so it's like it's I've 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 transformed. Like I've I've gone through a lot of transformations. A lot of transformations, you know. A lot of transformations. A lot. And I've also got that gift, you know, that's that's that gift, that's that moon, Tron, and Pluto, you know. So when this is, if you're not into astrology or knowledge yourself, you know, moon, the moon is who you are, you know. And and when it's, when it's in Tron with Pluto, it's like, the Tron is, is a gift, you know. So I have, I have the gifts to be able to, transform myself transform self i have the gift to be able to trans yeah transform myself into how i see fit you know basically not let people overtake me type shit and take power and control over me so that's that's just a normal aspect that i have you know so so yeah i've done a lot of transformations a lot you know and you know this is just an experience you know Const constantly constantly just experiencing you know so yeah, I guess this this has been a short video, but yeah, this is also Wednesday, so I'm utilizing my Mercury today, uh, more than ever at least. Not that on Mondays I'm not gonna talk just because it ain't we're not influenced by Mercury, but you know, this is communication is more keen today for me you can say that so yeah man it's like also having uh stellium in my sixth house of health stellium in my sixth house of health is like i've really shed some light on that too you know I, i'm not not only have i skipped vegan but it's like i'm now liquidarian you know, um, pranic breathing, you know, grazing breatharian. Uh, so whenever I come down, cause you know, I perceive me personally, I perceive eating as low vibrational to a certain extent, because you know, you are using your, uh, what's it called? You, some, you don't necessarily have to eat, you know. So, it is low vibration to a certain extent. But it's like, for me, I love nuts. I love snacking on nuts. And, you know, I be, I be 
I just be drinking. I just be drinking fluids, all sorts of fluids. And to make it plain and simple, I just I just eat what's uh, what I perceive to be food. And you know, my en our energies are not the same. So it's like the last thing I want to do is is to push out and say that oh, because this is working for me, it should work for you. Because that's not how it works. That's the last thing I want to do. Okay, so. Yeah, man. Values, values, values. This year, for me, my values have changed up. It's, it's, not, it's not the same. <laughs> you know, I've transformed that, you know. Okay. So, fresh sage shining out. I'm going to catch you next now.